Hey what's up guys, you're on the 52 back and today I have another reaction to Gintama, this time with episodes 874 and 175 I think. Um, really excited for today's episodes, I again can't remember what we saw in the preview, um, every time I watch the previews I can never remember the day after, apologies about that, uh, but it's just because the episodes usually tend to be so good I remember the episodes more uh, more than the preview. Uh, but yeah, yesterday's episode was absolutely amazing with Sadaharu kind of changing places with Gintoki in the last uh, last half of the episode and then uh, Gintoki changing places with Shinpachi or the real Shinpachi, uh, his glasses, um, and then the first half we had uh, the American um, slash Russian style Elizabeth, which uh, was absolutely player. I uh, love that half episode. I think uh, I think in this today's episode we've got um, the first episode here being another kind of half episode where we have two different stories. I think anyway, um, they're usually some of my favourite episodes. So coming for that, and then the episode after again, got no idea what's coming. Uh, we should have the red spider arc in a couple of days. So look forward to that on the channel. Uh, if you do like the video, please leave a like down below and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to the reactions. I usually react to Gintana every day um, or every other day but um, yeah let's get right into the video yep three episodes left of uh, this opening unfortunately and the ending which is over far too soon oh well still to combo man <laughs> I just love the little reference, well, not even references, just the little um, kind of appearances from a lot of the side characters. Even that guy there, which I didn't even notice before, is the, the guy from the um, dog dating episode ages ago, I think. And these are just the ones I noticed. <laughs> but yeah, there's definitely been so much like, but well, I don't even know if I call it improvement, because I listen to all the OPs and all the endings all the time, and I love them all. But they just do get better as they go along, man. Even though, like, uh, Mr. Raindrop's one of my favourite endings, that was second. The uh, the third opening's one of my favourites. But then you go opening four, opening five, opening six, this one. And I wonder what the next one has in store, man. <laughs> Let's go. So, what's the first half saying then? Got Mad Owl and an elevator. Oh, yeah, I think we might have got stuck in an elevator. That happened today in Evangelion as well. Oh crap, I think I was got repairs that day. Who's this guy? Oh, he's got debts as well. But two more professionals. What are they wearing? <laughs> the true fear. Ah, they were the same group. <laughs> they send them on the boats. Are there still people who go to the ocean and yell out, Baka Yellow? <laughs> Yeah, what what happens usually? I think it's in GTO. I found out people uh, that have jobs and stuff usually just get sent off over here, go fish and make some money. Yeah, so this is uh, this is the repaying of debts in fish. Must be pretty nice, to be fair. Ah, oh, you got one of the uh, one of the tail guys. Ryugu, but the Ryugu group. Ah, oh, three months. Only one way. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That was a big one. What would you even do? <laughs> yeah, all you have to do is shout something cool. <laughs> nice.
about guts. <laughs> I thought I that one. Kagura is looking cute. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, was that doll? <laughs> wow, that was a doll from the Ryuga arc, right? Or one of the arcs, I can't remember. Just a mad owl. <laughs> Black and yellow. Life is like fishing. Yep. Yep. <laughs> I believe it. Try another hundred times. Have your friends. You gotta get some guts, mad owl. Me now. Catch every fish in the damn ocean. Yep. Men you were united. Nice. <laughs> uh, that's ripped from one piece, isn't it? Nice. Wow. So are they all madhouse catchers? <laughs> oh god. What's happening now then? They just had a job. A nice bit of pay. Korean barbecue. Told you. Don't know if you'll ever make it there, unfortunately. What? <laughs> yeah. That sound nice. <laughs> nice guys had a long day at work. And they're stuck. That walk would wait. I've never been stuck on one, fortunately. I think I'd hate it. I usually take the stairs. Just uh, nice places I go anyway. Probably to subconsciously avoid this situation. Hour of Dragua. Yeah, like that's the reason. <laughs> The massive gap. No. And it's not possible that it'll still be going down right now. Is there an emergency button? Oh. Yep. No Korean barbecue, man. When a person is trapped, they're in a door open. See, that wasn't even half an episode, man. That was like a quarter of an episode. I would have liked to see a little bit more of that. Uh, boat trip. I feel bad for this poor guy stuck in here after a hard day at work. 
Now these guys had a hard day at work as well, of course. But this guy seems very tired. Oh. I was going to say for food. <laughs> the big red button. Oh god. <laughs> Pushed that way too hard. Yeah. <laughs> now this is all your fault. We could have actually got out of here. Would anyone know us? I mean they should do. Oh, everyone left, as expected. Oh, God. I'd hope so. Oh, don't tell me he has the security card. <laughs> so they didn't even start work yet. Wow. <laughs> ah. Tomorrow. Yeah, this guy just had his lunch, luckily. Oh, you're turning him red. Leave him alone, man. Oh, shit. Don't tell me it's Friday. <laughs> oh, no. Three day weekend. <laughs> yeah. Got a nice paycheck, we get a nice old meal. Fortunate. See, I'll try climbing out there, breaking the top. It'd be very dangerous. I would probably wouldn't try in real life. If I was an Arano character, I would. <laughs> Have to hang in there. Oh, this is a what the hell, man? How do we get out of this? I'm so smoke infested. Yeah, play a game or something. Yeah, bad vibes. <laughs> yeah, they're going to get hardly any oxygen. <laughs> These guys really got the worst, worst people to be with during this type of situation. <laughs> got to try and be proactive. Try and think of a way out. Already something to distract you. Salary man during the day. That does. Yeah, two jobs. On a day, one a night. There's a house involved. <clears throat> Oh. <laughs> 
Ah oh, man, this house fucking burnt down. He's got to pay his loans off for it. Still, maybe we shouldn't have discussed this. Damn. It could just be preparing you for a lovely Korean barbecue. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Oh. Oh, <laughs> so the Korean barbecue's out all burned down. Oh god. That's me. <laughs> yeah, the mood's just getting worse and worse, isn't it? I think you just gotta let go of it, Shimpaji, bro. Oh, ends it to a food he likes. Here we go again. <laughs> it will burn up. Funny that he said the house before the wife then. <laughs> yeah, stop. <laughs> stop, Shimpachi. It just make it worse. Yeah, don't worry, bro. <laughs> Fuck off. Yeah, good Toki, man. Stop thinking about that. Game. <laughs> She's up on flashbacks right now. Magical banana. <laughs> of course they do. Why? Why did they remind you of that? <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah, yeah. Try and be a little bit positive, bro. I mean, that's not the only thing that's happened in your life, is it? Might be the worst thing. But, uh... This is a weird game. <laughs> Alright, so we'll use some flames. Magical banana. <laughs> yeah. I'll never see again. <laughs> that was in that family. <laughs> Wait, this is so fucking so depressing. Oh my god. <laughs> We're down. Nice. 
mais. Mais. Put it behind you, bro. Nice. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, what did you mean by that? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Good time. This guy's wife is a fucking plastic. And Shinpachi's done for. Yeah, he got too worked up there. <laughs> Bro, they're not just meant to be sitting there cowering. Do something. Oh, you aren't going to be happy, security guard. <laughs> nice. We're getting out of here. They're inviting him as well. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think so. What are you gonna do? Oh god. <laughs> The best. <laughs> One last though. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I agree with that. <laughs> Catherine is the worst. Yes, you can, bro. Go slide down there. And of course. <laughs> well, you didn't need to. Or maybe his own path was waiting. Oh, so that was really awesome. Oh, however, however depressing. I expect the depressing bit to be the Mad Out episode, but the most depressing one was that one. <laughs> but yeah, not even a half and half episode today. It was like a quarter and then a three quarter episode. Really awesome though. And then uh, I think next episode we'll uh, have a little look at the preview before we watch that. But yeah, Yorozu is the best, bro. If only they had a little more patience, and if only Shinpachi would shut up. That would be really annoying me if he was doing that fucking banana game <laughs> in a stuck elevator. But that's your nice guy need. You need. That I need. Love a little pose by the feminist guy. <laughs> I'm gonna store this. <laughs> oh, baby. Oh. 
of me do. Okay, what we got coming up for next step then? Yada. People of all ages hate the dentist. Lover of alcohol and sweets is destined to have a cafe. <laughs> ah, they've all, ah, they've all got swollen cheeks. <laughs> oh god. Uh, the tears have stopped since last episode. <laughs> it's just in time, man. Every episode, bro. Okay, I got that good call that I got there, girl. Yeah, so, um, so Gintoki and uh, Hitchikata seem to have a few uh, teeth problems. So <laughs> I've had a few at my time as well. Had a, um, oh, I think like six or seven years ago, had a, uh, a root canal treatment on one of my teeth, and that was, uh, that was pretty painful. I think it worked though. I think there was like a 50% chance of it working or not. I remember that day because I got punched by a cat. They didn't have. <laughs> sounds weird, but I was. Uh, I remember I was going in and I saw a cat and I was going to be nice to her. This is where my almost hate of cats come from. I was going to be nice to him, stroke it, and then it didn't have any claws, but it just kind of slapped me on the face. I was like, ah, oh, all right. I don't get along well with cats. <laughs> And I'm allergic to dogs. I really love dogs. I've had a I used to have a German Shepherd who passed away. Um, now I've got a Pomeranian, but yeah, I'm allergic, so I try to keep away as much as possible. But I just like them too much, especially my old one, the German Shepherd, who's a big one. At the timer, counting down to the dentist. <laughs> He's desperate, man. <laughs> Kill me. Really troubled. I think they're gonna kill you. Yeah. <laughs> there's a there's a woman there with a kid, man. I'll be scaring him like that. <laughs> Sumi Massa. Oh jeez. Yeah, the same thing happened to me. I was going around the school with a big old lump and it was painful as fuck. I remember bastards touching it and hurting me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Scary equipments. Ah. <clears throat> That would be an interesting stat to find out how many people die a year from going to the dentist. <laughs> Probably not many. Are oh, your best mates here? <laughs> yeah, he's a smoker, so he's got problems as well.
Yeah. Check out on just in case you might be missing something. <laughs> oh, they're not listening to you. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunate. And what is your weakness? Oh. They both have the same weakness. <laughs> <laughs> Demon Vice Chief Scared of the Dentist <laughs> like you're scaring the kid. <laughs> you can't let him see that. <laughs> oh, why'd you come here? Now? <laughs> no fear of drills. <laughs> These guys are just bullshitting so hard. A monster. Hey, mad owl. Ah, he's got one as well. What's the reason for his there? <laughs> that sounds wrong, bro. Don't say you're there for a drill then. Oh no. Not what we will need to hear. So they wanted to get it all down in one go. <laughs> oh fuck. Oh no. <laughs> that sound, bro. Time. I don't know if you can call that treatment. <laughs> what? <laughs> Defibrillator? What? <laughs> I'm getting. Oh, man. If I was them, I'll get out of there ASAP. Ah. Yeah. Is he alright then? Nice. 
What is he looking like? That's what I want to know. In killers and a toothbrush specially made. Is oh nice, actually fine. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, <laughs> that's way beyond the equivalent exchange, bro. Real little uh, thought mail alchemist reference. Yeah, how are you getting your face down there? Ah, oh, Konda. <laughs> wow. Oh, so I switched his arm. <laughs> oh man the rock oh yeah why would you do that then <laughs> I mean that's more than harassment <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah yeah, this is body modification shit, bro. Get out of there, mate. Those two better, yeah. They've left. I thought it was those two I'd leave as well. I would have left a long time ago. Oh, their egos. <laughs> Give me 300 yen. Yeah, leave at the same time. Oh fuck. Two at a time. Yeah, are you guys seriously gonna head in there? Stop acting big. It will. <laughs> yes. Oh no, it's gonna be too late as soon as we get past those curtains, man. Ah. Uh. Oh fuck's sake, they come in. Mate, just look at this place. Yeah, it looks like a fucking crime scene. I need to stop swearing. Actually, need to stop swearing. <laughs> so hard with a series like this and stuff, though. I know it's not it's not hard, but very easily forgettable. Judge a person by their teeth. Looks and personality don't matter. <laughs> Check their boobs first. Yeah. And his teeth are absolutely ruthless. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, I'll go. Is it still going on about this? I don't even know what that is. Oh, nice. <clears throat> Those are maids. Okay, the one on the right looks alright. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my god, that thing looks scary. Hey, you got lucky again, Toki. <laughs> yes, you got lucky. Although, I'm not sure how well these two are going to be skilled. Yeah, you think you did. I'm not sure you did. Oh, wow. Oh, he chose the wrong one. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> you got lucky, Hitchika. Maybe. I mean, she looks normal, at least. Look at those weapons in the bag. It's looking like something out of Higarashi, bro. Oh fuck, she's one as well. <laughs> oh for fuck's sake. Oh wait, no, she was a double. What the fuck? Yeah, they're both battle fairies. Okay. That is. <laughs> yeah, I mean, at least you get a free drink, but they don't really sound like good options. Said. Yeah, that doesn't sound too bad. No. Oh, you don't want that massage. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do this. Pleasure for Betty. Ah, I see. That is pretty smart, although not very useful. Yes. Option X. Don't like where that's going. <laughs> A salad bar. I don't think, yeah, I don't think you're right there. I think they probably could. Oh, it's just some old guy with some salad. <laughs> oh, they literally gave him a bar. <laughs> well, they played him. No oh, baba. Oh, he's not even using mayo. They like getting rid of the penises, don't they? Oh, 
Oh man. Absolutely nothing. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Ah. Swift care. Oh, I see. I mean, you wouldn't have to do that if the treatment wasn't so fucked up. <laughs> yeah. Oh, poor guys. No. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Uh... Yeah, I was going to say, what kind of pain would these guys be feeling if they didn't have these guys attached to them? Uh, I don't think so, but <laughs> I mean, this is fucked. Yeah, that's Betty's life. <laughs> Oh god. So life's flashing before her eyes just before she dies of pain. What happens when they break? Do they start feeling the pain? Oh god. <laughs> wow. Yep. Yeah. This guy loves his veggies. Yeah, I mean, I look more like a man. Damn. I mean, at least it wasn't them here feeling the pain. What happened? Yeah, they got even bigger. Oh, they felt bad for him. Oh, man. They stopped the operation then. Ah. Oh, definitely a very interesting episode. <laughs> the old dentist, mate. I don't like the dentist either. As you guys can probably tell. But uh found something very powerful in something um what's his name said? Uh Steve um yeah, Steve -o, of all people. Um he was always very conscious about his teeth and such and he had like little nubs and his teeth taken out and obviously he got a new set in and such because he's uh obviously pretty well off now, but he was always very conscious and then he decided not really to care that much and uh his life bettered quite a lot for it and I was always like that as well, I always had a problem about him. Um never really smiled or anything. I was afraid to show my teeth and such just because I didn't look after myself when I was younger. But um yeah, then that Steve O kind of uh, quote and video that I saw helped me out quite a lot to be honest. Now I really couldn't give a shit what people think of me or all my appearance in that way. Obviously a, a little bit of me will always care but much less of a priority to hide myself away and not show the side of myself. I got a little bit deep there, sorry guys. <laughs> Just doing a uh, a Gintama episode for fuck's sake. That's the thing that Gintama brings you, man. It brings you these lovely little like plot points and stuff. A preview. The episode before we do the Red Spider. Countdown begins. We gotta fall off that again. Is this just gonna be another Yorozuya in the house episode? Probably, but they're always good.
So thanks for watching the video, guys. Really awesome episode there. Uh, first episode being absolutely amazing with this kind of one quarter, then uh, three quarters episode with Madao, uh, Kagura, Chimpachi, and uh, Gintoki. Sorry, uh, all going um, well. They got sent out fishing because they had to get a had to get a job to pay off some of their debts. And uh, I think in Japan um, it's quite popular for people, um, jobless people and such, just to go on the shores and go fishing for a couple months and uh, bring in loads of fish and get paid that way. But um, yeah, really awesome first half of that episode there. Would have would have actually loved a little bit more of that rather than uh, six minutes but um is what it is and then uh, in the second half uh, if i remember correctly uh, i can't actually <laughs> oh yeah we got stuck in the elevator uh with that very depressing guy and uh, that's probably why i kind of repressed that <laughs> just like that guy should do um well probably not actually that's not a good thing to do uh but yeah really awesome episode there and then today's um well this episode was absolutely brilliant as well with uh gintoki and uh, hijikata going to the dentist very much kind of uh, relate to that i was sure quite a lot of people do as well but um, as I mentioned at the end there very much kind of relate to this uh, having bad teeth and stuff um, again didn't really used to take care of myself all too much um, so yeah always kind of hid that away but um, as I said with the Steve-O kind of stuff and uh, just throughout anime and such in general just that kind of motivation just to uh, get past those problems as I said that people do like put in the past and repress um, getting past that is a uh, Hard thing to do, and I love that Gintama kind of brings up these plot points even with the comedy. Um, so yeah, absolutely loving the series so far. As mentioned, I'll be back tomorrow with episode 176, and then uh, the day after I'll be doing probably a double of the Red Spider arc, so I look forward to that. Uh, again, if you guys did like the uh, video, please leave a like down below and leave some comments with your thoughts down below as well. Uh, subscribe if you want to keep up to date with the videos as well. Very close to a 1,000 subscribers, which is my goal, but, uh, hopefully at some time before February or during February, hopefully. Um, but yeah, just a uh, like or just a watch is even enough for me. Uh, thank you guys watch him. Have a good rest of your day.